he is watching, they're holding each other up. They are. Uh, Ellis and Ryan, and that's certainly letting them get close, and it's also helping Penrose in second place. He can concentrate on what he's doing, knowing the pair behind are scrapping oh, and at every corner. Oh, um, Kivalova's Healy 3000 is off on the side of the, uh, uh, between the kink and woodcut. Uh, on the grass and uh, there we go the elite goes wide the MG balls up the inside gets really crossed up slides he catches it amazingly well because uh, that looked like it was a um Kind of just uh, destined to lend up in the uh, in the barrier, but he caught it brilliantly, Ryan. He hasn't lost a lot of uh, ground to the others, has he? Amazing. He looked up the inside, and it all went a bit sort of haywire. But he's, he's caught it beautifully. So Here we go. Talk us through this moment. Yeah, he looked up the inside. He had that gap onto the second apex. He dived up. Uh, the cars didn't touch. He touched the curb on the inside. He got flung sideways, and it went across the track, up over the curbs on the outside. He caught it. Now he's having to go down the inside in the grass. That's um, a dangerous tactic uh, because. So it could so easily end up with both cars going off. It was like WWF wrestling. There was a show. Yeah. Not just what happened on the circuit, but afterwards. I mean, I've been insulted by Alan Menu. I've been strangled by Ricard Rydell. <laughs>